Alrighty guys, we have made it to the final part of Uncharted. And <laughs> I'm sorry for yelling. I am just so pumped and excited to finally show the ending of this game to you guys. And it's just been quite a journey. I'm so thankful for all of you guys. I can just see the viewership, the likes on every single part. And I'm just excited to see you guys bringing that energy too. But anyways, I, you know, I don't really know what brought me to this love of creating content. I mean, I always love watching people do it. And I don't know what drove me to be able to want to do that myself. It just kind of happened one day where I was like, I kind of want to do that. And, you know, we all find our own hobbies in that. And I'm just glad that I found something that I enjoy as much as this. And I love doing this for you guys. So thank you guys for this opportunity. And I hope it uh, has many more uphills to come, you know? I guess that makes sense. <laughs> anyways, let's hop into this final part. I'm gonna go eat, like, you know, an Eggo or something to chill out. But anyways, let's hop into this final part of the series. The next uh, Naughty Dog game we're gonna play is The Last of Us, and I cannot wait. But anyways, let's get this. Is it far? Not very. Just through this port. <laughs> Something tells me that everything's going to go to according to plan. What if Shoreline set up an ambush by the plane? They didn't. And what makes you so sure? Because they're heading to the mountain. For the treasure. This way. <clears throat> there she is. It's a long drop. How did you get here? I hopped down a few of these walls, but... We'll have to find another way around. I mean, can't we just jump into the ocean? Can you imagine, like, if this place did exist? Like, the tourist attraction it would make? I jumped down from up there. But it's too high to get back up. Yeah, maybe there's something we can put under it? Here we go. I already figured it out. Give me a hand, Sam. All right. I feel like Sam's gonna do something, though. I mean, there's no way he's all right with this. Hey, you need a hand? Yeah, no thanks. We got it. Well, that's not what I meant to do. I feel like I almost missed that. I've been recording like all day. I'm like getting so tired, but I kind of want to finish this game today. Something tells we're not going through there. Right here. Here we go. All right, we'll just go right here. Hey guys, through here. Uh. Huh. This ain't working. Oh, here we go. Definitely this. Where'd Sam just go? Oh, check that thing out. Oh, there it's he like is. A sky rail or something. I think it still works. Only one way to find out. I mean, aren't we gonna try this? There we go. There's no controls, but I bet I could pull the platform with my rope. I probably just made a mistake. What are you doing, kid? Uh, no idea. I'm not sure yet. Maybe if you could get to that wooden platform down there. Well, we're getting there. I can't wait to sleep in my own bed again. So close, yet so far. All right. I don't... Nathan, give me a hand. What are you talking about? I'm just... <laughs> uh. Just get me over there. Whatever. <laughs> oh, no, Nate! 
All right. What what what, what did you want to hand with? Guessing it was something over here. Huh. Here we go. Okay. You know what I need? I need a standing desk when I get tired of sitting. Okay, Victor, can I borrow you for a sec? Sure. All right, go ahead, Nathan. There, we'll hold it down. You jump across. Oh. oh what the hell are you doing? Hey, don't mess around, kid. I'm just testing the weight. You guys are going to push it out further? I guess not. Made it! Here we come. Got it. All right, hop on. I'll pull you across. Come on. Okay, we're ready. Well, this is some impressive engineering for a bunch of pirates. Whoa! Hang on! You guys all right? Yeah. It's like a roller coaster. Come on up, Nathan. I guess. All right. All right, Nathan, you climb on up. I'll grab you. Oof. Go! Jump off quick! Nate, give me a hand. I'm coming. Sam! Bitch! Sam, come on! Huh? Right. Come on, just jump, I'll catch you. Let's go. No, no, don't you even think about it, you hear me? I'm sorry I got you into this. All of you. Hey, all of that doesn't matter anymore, okay? Just, just jump. I gotta see this thing through, Nathan. Sam, hey, listen to me. If you do this, I'm not coming after you. You hear me? I'm sorry. Sam. Sam! Oh, stupid, stupid. You called your bluff? He's gonna get himself killed. Come on. She's, she's probably right. Of course she is. Let's go. All right. Up here. Maybe we can head him off. I'm gonna save him, and I'm gonna punch him. All right, let's just worry about the saving part first. What the hell is he thinking? I mean, after everything that we... Wasn't this enough? Let's just find him. Some things just aren't enough, Nathan. Hey, we can get over that wall with this. <sighs> Come on. Here, we got you. What are you guys gonna help? You ready? <clears throat> nice. Teamwork. You know, I've been recording for like the last four hours or so, four or five hours. Got it. Oh. All right. See? This isn't gonna hold. Dang, go. No, I got it. Oh. supposed to get up there we don't have enough time Nate no not by yourself Look, I'll come right back okay Look, he is not gonna leave without a fight yeah, well then I'll fight him if I have to but either way I'm bringing him back just get the plane as close to the mountain as you can and be ready for a quick getaway like there's another kind it's not fair Doing the dishes, we take turns. Don't even think about not coming back. <laughs> I love you. Same to you, cowboy.
21. Brother's Keeper. Alright, let's get up this mountain. Okay. Uh. Where are we going? Oh, over here. This game is really building up to the final fight. I can feel it. Hey, what's that? Footprints. Sam! God, they definitely gotta be Sam's. I'm sure he's a ways of... All right, here we go. Just gonna head to the creepy mountain, save Sam, get the hell out of here. Yeah, be laughing about the whole thing tomorrow. Ooh. All right. We can do this. I knew Sam wasn't going to come easy. I knew we couldn't just give that up. So, how much further do we got to go? Here we go. Back on the trail. The footprints end here. Um... Here we go. Come on, which way did he go? What? Did my thing just like fail? Equipment failure. So it looks like we're gonna be going a uh, quite a while. All right. Back and forth. What? How did I how did I miss that? Well I still miss that. Whatever. Alright, third time's the charm. That one I totally could have made it. Alright, here we go. Finally. I don't know why that took so long. You know, I'm just having a blast with this game. I can't seem to put it down. Alright. Ooh. Please make it. How did I miss that? Come on, man. Ooh. Finally. I only took one more try after that. You didn't fall to your death, so that's good. I'll be honest, I would have died a long time ago in this story. Uh, here we go. Can we make this without dying? Oh my god. Jesus Christ. You're telling me, brother. Uh... Here we go. Yo, that tree is wobbling. Um, here we go. <clears throat> now I need something to clear my throat. Actually, where are we going? Oh, what's this? Old campsite. I really hope we're close. <laughs> More footprints. Well, in we go. Hey, Sam! You know, I went and grabbed an ice pack because... Oh, my goodness. Please don't break. Come on. Because it can get super hot in here, and I don't like having my, like, AC on, because you can hear it vaguely in the bath background. Oh, there you are. Okay. Here we go. Oh, uh, we can make it. Sam! Please don't break. Oh, crap!
Oh. Okay. Whew. All right. So far, so good. Can we actually make that? Oh. Jesus. I swear, Sam, if Rafe and Nadine don't kill you, I just might. Same here. I could be at home in a warm bed. All right. You know, I'm kind of fine with exploring just to... Oh, come on. I'm kind of fine exploring, you know, because that just means I don't have to deal with the bad guys at the moment. Well, no day like today. Holy crap. Oh god, this is so much harder than it looks. Uh Oh my goodness. Don't tell me we seriously got to do this. Well, nothing like the present day. I come on, man. All right, back. I can barely. I can do it. Oh shit! Oh. Oh, my body hurts. Yeah, I know with the Tomb Raider games, they had the. The option where you press like, what was it? Y to like hang on or something. We just whoa! Look at that! Oh my god, that's Avery's ship. We we made it. You know what I might do? I might just press my luck. Okay. Can we just jump to the other side? Oh. And what are we doing over here? No. Nope. Here we go. And we'll get up here. I don't even know if this is the right way. I think it is. No! I mean, this was Minecraft, I would have already jumped into that water. I guess this is my way down. Alright, so please just tell me I don't have to rope on or something. Oh, no. Oh no! Here we go. And this water is Did so you really clear. Do all that, Sam? I doubt it. All right. You know, I went uh, snorkeling in what was it? I forget what it was called. A hot spring, I think. And it was so cool. I remember seeing a turtle and all that. Like, those waters are so clear. I did that in Florida, I remember. I'm guessing we're diving again. Here we go. Done here? This is the last of them, ma'am. Good. If we are here, we can catch up with the others. <sighs> Sam just stole our goddamn boat. He's headed for Avery's ship. Come on. Let him. We're done. 
we're done. Most of my men are dead, Reif. And those who aren't have already left. Can you see that? The end is literally in sight. That maniac pirate of yours has rigged this entire cave. I'm not setting foot on his ship. Nadine, if you cut and run right now, the loss of all your men, everything that we've done, is for nothing. We have millions in gold right here. I'd say that plus our lives is something. No wonder so many of your men abandon you. Excuse me? We're on the verge of making history here, and you're willing to just walk off with a pittance, a fraction of what Sam's gonna get from that boat. If he can walk away from that ship alive, he can have it. Hell, I'd say he's earned it. God knows you didn't. Now look, we can stand here and insult each other all day, or we can finish what it is that we've done. <laughs> Oh, we're finishing it, all right. Sorry, ma'am. Yeah. Thing about mercenaries, Nadine, their loyalty, it's bought. It's not earned. Now, come on. Either we can finish this thing together. Or we can just end it right here. Let's go make history. And a girl. By all means. <laughs> You know, I dropped my controller during that cutscene. I almost thought I was gonna skip it. Um, here we go. The fact that everyone wants to leave this ship alone is really saying something. Let's see what you have in store for us, Captain Avery. A thief's end. I'm guessing we're gonna go swim to the ship. This makes me think of the Goonies, you know, the ending of it. That's not good. We gotta get up there pronto. Imagine how cool it would be to find a pirate ship, though. I mean, I can't even imagine. Shoreline. Well, that dude's not walking away. Uh, here we go. We're in the captain's quarters. Oh, crap! Sam! That's not good. Getting smoke from the bottom. Oh, here we go. Whoa. Look at that. There's your treasure. Oh my god. God damn. I'll be honest, I want just one of these gold coins as a souvenir. <laughs> just one. That's all I want. Sam? Uh, I don't know if I should open this. You guys see these ropes? Sam? Sam? Hey, Nate. Where is Sam? Oh, he's right there. Sam? Relax, he's alive. Well, this idiot nearly got us all killed. I'm getting him out of here. 
No, you're not. Rafe, you can have the treasure, all right? Just let me save my brother. <coughs> <laughs> After everything he's done? How noble of you, but no. We stay here any longer and we're all dead. Is that what you want? It's not what I said. What do you think, Nadine? <coughs> Good to see you up and about. Be a dear and relieve Nate there of his gun. Hand it over. You really think you can trust him? Huh? Not your concern. Now, why are you trying to instigate? Nate? Nadine and I are partners. I don't screw over my partners. Get over there. You and your brother, though. Right from the start, you took advantage of my generosity. You tried to cut me out, and it's high time you learn. What are you doing? Now you give me your gun. <laughs> Nadine? I won't ask you again. You are being profoundly stupid right now. Look over there. Nadine, stop screwing me up. Jesus! I said look! Okay, it's a couple of skeletons. So what? I don't know as much about history as you boys, but I've got a pretty good idea who those two are. Well, enlighten us. It's Avery and two. They killed each other. Good for them. What's the point? Everyone obsessed with this treasure gets what they deserve. So what, you're just leaving us here to die? Oh, I'm just leaving. Whether you die or not, I don't really care. Nadine, wait. So long, Rafe. Nadine! Nadine! You open this goddamn door right now! Rafe, she's gone! Come on, give me a hand, we'll all get out of here. won't work. Come on, help me with Sam and I'll help you open the door. No, I'm not going to be able to enjoy one of these coins. Knowing that you and your worthless brother are still sucking air. I just... Just calm down. You can practice your fencing when we get outside. Nate, just shut up. Oh, Seriously, no. Rafe, this is insane, even for you. You want to hear insane? Nathan Drake raced a madman and his entire army to the steps of Shambhal. Oh, Jesus. Nathan Drake found the lost city in the middle of the Rub al Kali desert. <laughs> God damn it. Come on, we can get out of here together. Nathan Drake discovered the fabled El Dorado. <laughs> Come on, Rafe. Stop. Nathan Drake. He's a legend. <laughs> you know, I, I shot the man who told me that. Look, I get it. You don't like me very much. You know, for all your greatness, Nate, you have nothing. You are nothing. And I warned you to get out of my way. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I have sacrificed everything to find Avery, and I'm not gonna let a couple of stupid thieves, a senile con man, and a washed up journalist take that away from me! You care about that parade of losers so much, I'm going to make sure they join you. On guard, dickhead. That's the spirit. Bring it. Okay. This has got to be by far the coolest boss fight of this game. Oh, shit. Ouch. <laughs> okay. Okay. 
Oh. Bring it, Rafe. Oh, dang it. Harry. Oh. Come on, man. Okay. Ah. Make it too easy. Okay. Oh, here we go. And got him in the leg. Oh, jeez. Come on. Oh, my goodness, man. Now we're getting somewhere. What the hell is wrong with you? Oh my goodness. This is tricky. He has lost his marbles. Ah. So I do know kind of what we're doing now. Oh. Apparently not. Oh my goodness. That didn't go as planned. Come on, bring it. Why couldn't they just made it one attack? Come on. Get off me! Ooh, got him right in the chest. Come on, legend. Oh. Yo! Oh my god! Oh! Oh. Being nervous is um, the understatement of the century right now. Oh my goodness! Oh. oh! I am just barely surviving this. Ooh. Sir! Come on! Ooh. Oh my god. Oh. This sweat is unbearable. Oh, come on. Oh. Ah, I keep forgetting about that. There we go. Okay. Got him. Come on, Nate. Escape struggle. Come on. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Oh. Okay. I am like two seconds away from death. Okay. Oh, man. Oh. He keeps getting me. Oh, dang it. All right, bring it, Rafe. Yeah! 
Here we go. Now that's the Nathan Drake I hear so much about. All right, all right. We're done here. I'm taking my brother and we're leaving. You want to stay in Burma, the ship, you be my guest. You got me. You know what, Nate? Underneath all the bravado, you're just a sad little boy with delusions of grandeur. Who, by the way, can't fence for shit. So long, Nathan Drake. Nathan! Oh, my goodness. You don't know what to give up. That's good. Don't hand it to me. I had everything handed to me on a goddamn silver platter. Everything except I earned this. All of it. You want the treasure, Rafe? It's all yours. Holy shit! Hey, come on, let's get you out of here. It's too heavy. Strike it. Try again! It's no use. Come on! Take this! Damn it! Listen to me! Listen to me! All I ever wanted to do was find this treasure with you. Sam, hey, sure. we did it. We did it, brother, okay? It's all right. There's gonna be another way. Nathan, you gotta go. There's gonna be some. You gotta go! This tumped! There is no other way! Come on, Nathan, I gotta know you made it out all right. Nathan, the whole place is about to blow up! That's it. That's it! The hell you don't! It's trust me! God damn it! Just get your head down! Do it now! Come on! She's one to know it. Come on. That was probably one of the hardest boss fights I have done. But the coolest as well. Crap. I don't know if we can make this out. Sam, don't stop. Don't stop. Come on.
So, you got everything? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, feel free to sell anything I left behind. <laughs> sure, I can't give you a lift home. After the last few days, I think I'd like a plane with drink service and reclining seats. Plus, uh, she and I have a lot to talk about. Yeah, you do. And no more late-night phone calls about one last time. <laughs> Promise. Thanks, Sally. Take care, kid. Don't be a stranger. Next time you're in town, beers are on me. I'll hold you to that. <laughs> and then the bunny escapes anyway, and it leaves little bunny surprises all over the headmaster's bed. Hey, 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 what are you telling her? Just about your little magic phase. Oh, I hate you. What was your stage name? Go on, tell her. Nate the Great. <laughs> it's not funny. It makes sense. In his defense, he was actually, you were pretty good. Uh-huh. Mm. Hey, look, Sam, it has been an experience getting to meet you. With the handshake? Well... Bring it in for the real thing, sister. You take care of this gnome skull, all right? Yeah, I will. I'll join you in a sec. Yeah. I like her. God help her, she sure seems to love you. <laughs> I know, right? Listen, the offer still stands. I appreciate it, but I'm good. I know, but if you feel like you're imposing, it's, you're not. We not talked about, about that. it. It's not about that. It's a little bit of that, okay? Yeah. But I just kind of thought that after we found Avery's treasure, I'd be satisfied. Uh -huh. Instead, I've uh, <laughs> kind of left with this strange feeling of emptiness. Yeah. Yeah, well, you know, as thrilling as the next adventure might be, in the end, I always left with that same feeling. And sometimes you just gotta choose what you're gonna keep and, and what you're gonna let go. Well, I guess I'm just not there yet. And besides, you know, you've got a few ancient cities on me, and I can't let that slide. So. Yeah, I left a couple out there. Well, thank you. <laughs> oh, that's, that's our ride. Yeah. Uh, Sam. Come far. We sure have a little brother. Come here. Listen, you don't do anything I wouldn't do, all right? Get out of here, Vemus. <laughs> Good night. Yeah. So, Victor. What's next for you, hmm? Hmm. <laughs> well, before I got dragged into this, I was working on a business deal of sorts. Of sorts? Hmm. Dangerous? Mm hmm. With these people, yeah. It's up there. Well, I just so happen to know a certain someone recently out of prison who might be perfect for this kind of work. Ooh, I don't know. Is he trustworthy? More or less. As is Portuguese. Quando seu marido volta para casa? What's that mean? How long before your husband gets home? <laughs> That'll do. Come on. You got any more of those cigars? Don't push your luck. What's going on? Land a big contract or something? Oh, even better. I'm on the verge of selling Jameson Marine. No kidding? Yeah. Wow, that... Well, hey, I guess, I guess congratulations are in order, huh? Well, not yet, but I'm confident it'll go through. They drove a hard bargain, but in the end, I think we came to a mutually beneficial agreement. That's, that's great. Are, are you gonna stay on? 
No, 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 no. I think I'd like to just relax, hang with the family, go fishing every chance I get. <laughs> Good for you. <laughs> so who's the sap who's gonna buy this place? Oh, uh, you are. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, come on, seriously. Oh, yeah, seriously. <laughs> wait, Jameson. Hey, wait, wait up, man. Hey, morning, guys. What are you doing here? Just thought I'd take, you know, one final look. Already gave your husband the keys. Okay. Perfect. Is, is this for real? Nate, all you need to know is that you'd be making a very wise investment. Do the right thing here. Call me when you're through. You got it. Hi. Hi. You're, you're buying Jameson Marine? We are buying Jameson Marine. Oh, okay. How? Why? Well, I heard this rumor about a salvage job off the coast of Malaysia, and I thought it'd be right up no, our alley. No, Honey, look, we barely got out of Libertalia alive. Yeah. Hey, taking an illegal job? You know what that leads to. Who said it was illegal? <laughs> Look. This came in this morning. Is this legit? Yeah. Some of my old contacts out there, they worked their magic with the Malaysian permit office. <laughs> it was great. I didn't even have to bribe anyone. Well, that's good, because I don't know how we could possibly even afford to do this. Here. Hold out your hand. What? Hold out your hand. Come on. Holy crap. Where did you get this? It was in my jacket pocket. <laughs> Along with a bunch more. A bunch? Sam. He's a sneaky one. Yeah. Of course, most of them are gonna have to go into our venture here, along with all the new camera gear. Camera gear? Yeah. You know, I figured as we're pulling all the cargo up from the dive, we could hire, you know, a small crew. We could film the whole thing and resurrect my old show. What happened to just... Living a normal life. I think in our attempt to lead a normal life, we may have oversteered. Look, when I was on that island, I missed the adventure. I missed us. And so now we have a chance to do what we love. But from here on out, we are gonna operate on a strictly legal basis, all right? And I will be doing all of the shooting with my really expensive camera. Wow. You've really thought all this through, haven't you? More or less. But listen, just say the word and I will call the whole thing off. What? Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, I don't want to be that guy who ruins Jameson's early retirement like that. That'd be cruel. Right. <laughs> it's not gonna be easy, you know. Nothing worthwhile is. So. What do you say, Nathan Drake? Sure, why not? Hmm. Yeah, as long as I don't have to do any paperwork. <laughs> well, I can't do it. I'm gonna have my hands full with the camera. Well, I'm gonna have my hands full with all the diving. Okay, fine. We'll take turns. Yeah. Or I could play for it. Seriously? No, listen, I have been practicing. I'm getting good. No. My hand eye is way I better than it used to be. Your... Really? 
<laughs> I cannot do that to you again. Are you afraid to play me? I am so not afraid, On a to scale play of you. one to ten, how scared are you to play me? Like a three. Yeah, well, jack that up to like 11, all oh, right? Because uh, I'm coming for you. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, my. That's. Okay. Fine. You're on. Oh, shoot. We're actually playing this again. I'm going to lose. 100%. You know, I think this is just such a great game, and I'm having just a blast with it. I think that this, like, kind of ending so far has just been so great. Alright, we got this. Let's see if we can make it further than at the beginning of the game. We got one more. Uh-oh. Oh, no! <laughs> Why do I always suck at that part? We got one life left. We can do this. All right. My cat is going berserk in the background right now. She just doesn't like it when I play games and not giving her attention. All right. Boink, boink. Here we go. Fence. Another fence. Another fence. Another fence. Another fence. <laughs> there we go. Oh. Here we go. I think I might actually do this, maybe. Oh no. No. I think that was it. Oh, we finally got a uh what you caught. Checkpoint. Never mind. Well, that sucked. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! This is not what I thought it was. Is she who I think she is? What's this? Old school. Oh my goodness, that brings back some memories. Is this their daughter? <laughs> we got Savage Starlet so over there. Makes me think of Temple Run a little bit. Interesting. I really should clean this up. Eh, later. Oh, you play the guitar? I play it. Okay, so this is the epilogue. Mom? Dad? The doggy. Anyone? This whole house is a mess. Wait, what's this over here? I'm just gonna enjoy my time. Oh, that looks beautiful. Uh oh. Hmm. <laughs> Sorry, Sully. <laughs> wow, Sam looks so young. Wow, so this is their daughter. It's crazy. You know, I'm like 21 right now, but who knows? Maybe in the next 10 years, I'll become a father. All right, the dog wants our attention. What do you want it? All right, I'll follow you. Actually, can I like run? There's a. All right, what's going on? I'm coming. Yoo-hoo! Well, so cool. Oh wow! I need to ask mom to borrow this one again. Old style. So what's going on? Anything in here? Huh? <laughs> All right. Actually, wait. You got. I should probably turn that off. Oh no, that is no, that no, no. <laughs> taste in music, but I kind of like this one. 
I got a copyright for that at the beginning of my series. I know that much. And I didn't want to re-record it. I like I see before I post videos, I check out. Uh, like I put them up on YouTube just as a test, and uh, that song specifically got me a copyright. I think they abandoned us. That's what I do like with all my videos. I put them up like as soon as I'm done recording with them to see if there's any like type of, you know, problem with them. Here we go. Calm down. All right. This is a nice house. It's a lot of mail. All right, read. Oh, cool. Sam and Sully are coming to visit. Your pal, Victor. All right, we can flip it. Hey, look, look at that. These two. Sully never ages. You know, after this, I think I'm gonna like watch the Uncharted movie. Guess we're going outside. Hey. <laughs> Off she goes. Oh my god, this is so beautiful. My mom would love this. She loves the beach. Man, I would love to have a house ah, right on the beach. Perfect day. Now all we need is the rest of our boat crew. Got the chairs. Can I sit here? This is the dream right here. Ah, oh, man. I feel like I could sit here all day. Oh, there's the suits over here. Anything to look at? Doesn't look like it. So we got two houses, it looks like. And not here either. Okay, I guess I'll just wait then. Oh wow, look at this. Oh yeah, I was hanging out with Soli for this one. Hmm. Oh, this was definitely my favorite dig. <laughs> look at you all bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. So it looks like we could look like almost at every one. For that one. <laughs> I remember that one. That's pretty cool. What's this? You figured it out. Hmm. Yo, look at this. Whoa. Good job cleaning this up. My cat is going crazy in the background. What do you want, Delilah? The search area narrowed down quite a bit. You know, I should really take a class on how all this works. Like nautical stuff and, you know, sky charts. Anything back here? Oh, this is where the photos are developed. <laughs> photos in this game are really well done. Wait, what does that say? Journalism award. Got all the fishing gear and scuba gear. Nice. What we got here? <laughs> so goofy. Oh, wow. Hmm. He left his keys. He left his keys. Oh. You know, I have a thing specifically like that. It holds my uh, arrows for my bow and arrow. There's no way. There's just no way. Uh. Whoa. Uh, I knew it. 
So this is basically the encyclopedia of Nathan. What is this? Hmm. I mean, I already know what that is. The skull. Kind of creepy. Indiana Jones, the Crystal Skull. Cool. Come in theaters near you. Hello. Oh my god. Pretty sure we already read this, but uh let you guys read it if you want to. Whoa. Henry Avery the Gunsway Heist. Wait, did you go looking for Avery's treasure? Where did it go? What's that? No way. Is that dad? Sick Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Huh. What's this? What the hell? Oh shit. Crap. Hey, there you are. Hey. Been looking for you. What are you doing in here? Uh, looking for you guys. Come on, we loaded up the boat. It's ready. Cool. I'll catch up with you guys in a sec. Why? Uh, I just need to, um,. Uh, What's up, Cassie? Okay. Don't be mad. Hey, I said don't be mad. Keys. So... What did you see? Nothing really. Well, just that photo of you two and Sully. With a bunch of Spanish looking treasure. And a shotgun. Yeah. Huh. This is bound to happen sometime. Maybe we should just tell her. She's not ready for it. Ready for what? All that crazy shit in there? Language. Yeah, language. Sorry. But you guys are literally keeping skeletons in your closet. Or at least a, a silver skull of some kind. You no, know, I don't think I'm ready for this. Really. Nate, it's time to have the talk. <sighs> yeah, it's totally time. Wait, which talk are we talking about here? She's just a kid. She's older than you and Sam when you started That's, all of this. That is different, and you know it. Okay, look, if you guys were into some shady stuff, it's totally cool. <laughs> But I think I'm old enough to know about it, right? Old enough? How old are you again? Ha, <laughs> funny. Mom? All right. Well, let's see. Um, for me, it started when this guy called me up with a scoop on a massive historical find. <laughs> sounded like a complete fraud. Yeah, handsome fraud. No, I hadn't even met him yet. Oh, she knew. <laughs> she knew. So this fraud says, if you fund the trip, then I'll give you the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. And for the record, I totally delivered. <laughs> yeah, you delivered us into the hands of Indonesian pirates. No, oh, come on, you know I had nothing to do okay, with that. Okay, guys, time out. You're saying that you were attacked by pirates after you found the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. Is that right? Yeah, yeah that, pretty that's much right. it. Yeah. Bullshit. Language. Language. Crap. Better. 
All right, so keep going. You know what? The sun is up, boat's ready, wind is just right. You want to continue the story? I say we do it on the water. Come on. But well, wait, what would Francis Drake look like? Was it gross? Actually, he wasn't in there. Yeah, just his journal with a map to El Dorado. The city of gold? Uh, that's the legend. Turns out it was just a statue, a cursed statue. No way, seriously? Yeah, seriously. But uh, I'll get back to that later. But, see, the map led us to the middle of the Amazon jungle. Alrighty guys, so that was Uncharted 4. I'm just wrapping my mind around that whole game. I finished this game in probably about like three days. I mean, I did, what was it, like two days with like six hour recording sessions. And then I played for about like, I don't know, four or five hours, uh, like the first day, I think. But what I have to say about this game was just phenomenal. I mean, the game looked absolutely beautiful, especially for being like, uh, what was that, on PlayStation 4, this came out. The graphics look absolutely beautiful. They still stand up for today. And the story, I mean, it's like watching a movie half the time. Cutscenes last like around 10 minutes or so. I remember, I think it was like uh, the first part. I'm thinking, where am I gonna cut this off? Or it was like the second part too. I'm thinking, cause like I try and prepare these videos like for ahead of time, I look for good stopping places and I write them down in like a notebook. And for the second part, I was like, where am I gonna stop this at? And that's getting a little too long right there. Um, I thought this game was phenomenal. So we have finished all the Uncharted games and wow, I'm just sad to see this game go. I'm gonna be playing it again in my spare time, but I only get to play it once for you guys, which is kind of sad. I mean, there might be a time later down the line. Let's say this uh, hit this game, it's 20 years old. I mean, it just hit eight years old. I mean, I could probably play it when it hits 10 years old. I mean, that's just kind of pushing it though. Uh, I thought this game was amazing. I had just the funnest time playing it. It kind of made me think of when I first played the Tomb Raider games. I didn't, I had never seen them before. I had only watched the last one, so like the first two, I think it was, I had no idea what I got myself into, and when I was playing it, I was just having a fun time, not knowing what was going to happen, and I haven't seen this game in so long. I don't even think I ever watched it fully through, so a lot of this was just me experiencing it for like the first time, which was really cool and nice to do. Uh, so... I mean, oh my goodness, all three games, we have finished them, and I just think they did such a great job with this one. From going to the last one, uh, they just stepped up their game like 10 notches. I mean, the combat, I mean, the, you know, the melee and the gun mechanics just felt so nice. I think in the last games, they, they had a little bit of a, you had a little bit of help, it felt like, or maybe I'm just misremembering it. Uh, I felt like this one required you to, you know, be more precise with the gun. And I did like that. So it had me focusing a lot more on trying to be more accurate. I think, uh, if, uh, <laughs> I think uh, you could probably count on both hands on how many headshots I've probably gotten in the, the whole game so far. I don't think I got many. Uh, but I thought this game was just amazing. My cat is going crazy behind me. She is probably one of the most vocal cats I will you know ever meet but this game so we start off the game actually how did we start off the game didn't we start it off in prison oh no no we started it off uh on the boat and i love the intro it kind of made me think of what was it the second game when you start off on the train i uh, you're just like whoa what is going on this is so cool i did like how they did that just a little bit of uh what is to come and then we skipped to what did we yeah we skipped to prison actually or no, it wasn't prison. We skipped to a flashback of when we were kids in the orphanage. So I actually didn't expect there was going to be two flashbacks to that. It got split up one at the beginning of the game and then one towards the end of the game, which by that point, I didn't think we were going to get any more flashbacks. So that was kind of nice when we got to go back and learn a little bit more about the brothers. So I really like that. 
And then we went to prison, and we were there looking for the tower for Avery. You know, actually, the whole premise of this game, Libertalia, pirates, already had me captivated. I love anything that has to do with pirates. I actually, this game got me to do a bunch of research on pirates in real life, and I feel like I've come out of this game knowing more than what I went into this game, which is kind of funny when a game makes you want to do some, you know, historical research. Uh, I know a lot of stuff about pirates now, you know, privateers, buccaneers, and just the difference between all of them. Uh, I know a lot about the pirates and everything, so I felt pretty well acknowledged when it came to this game a little bit, because this game got me to do a lot of that research. So. I don't know if that was just kind of it. I just have a love for pirates and that. So already I was kind of a little biased when I'm going into this game. I'm like, I already love it. I felt like this game was going to be very special and it just felt very special. Man, I got to talk about that ending boss fight was pretty cool. I mean, you know, I think the hardest boss fight in the Uncharted series was probably Lazarevich. I struggled with that boss fight. Oh my goodness. I think it took me like... I don't know, 30 minutes to an hour to like finally beat him. I remember the first uh, go I had at him, I almost beat the boss. And then after I like died, I kept dying to him. And I wasn't even getting close to how far I got to begin with. I felt like that boss was just so long and drawn out and was just so irritating to do. This boss, Rafe, uh, as the final boss fight, I didn't feel like that. It was definitely difficult. And it was hard to like gauge the sword swinging because it wasn't just one button it was two it was the triangle for left and then a circle for the right which it was kind of hard to gauge that here and there because it's all happening so quickly and but i still had a fun time with that boss fight i think it i only died like maybe four times four or five times and with a little bit of cut and editing i can fix all that but I thought that boss fight was really cool. I liked how engaged you were, and I was so close to death so many times. Um, I just really enjoyed this game. If I had to like rate this game, I definitely, I mean, there was a little bit of times. I, I don't like how they did a little bit of trying to open area, because it's like, what's the point of doing open world? Because there's not much we can gain from it. You know, it's not like... We're going for different guns that we get to keep. They run out of ammo and stuff like that. So I didn't really have a want to kind of really explore. I mean, the only thing you're looking for is treasure, and that doesn't really do anything. That's just for collectibles. So I felt like the open world aspects wasn't really needed. Were they beautiful and just a nice touch? 100%, I got to say. I mean, I don't really got a complaint when it comes to it. This game really didn't hold your hand when it was telling you where to go. So there was definitely a few times where I was kind of lost and uh, trying to find my way to places. I mean, I did like that because it kind of forced me to kind of like figure it out myself. I, I really like linear games when you just kind of like, well, you kind of already know that's where I got to go or that's kind of what I got to do. This game kind of did that, but it like opened the world a little bit where you're just like, where do I kind of go? I'm not entirely sure. So... I do, I gotta say, this game was phenomenal. I 100% enjoyed it, and I can't wait to play Lost Legacy. I mean, I definitely don't think it's gonna be as good as this, but it's definitely gonna be something. Actually, Nadine was probably one of my favorite antagonists of the game. I'm really glad we get to see her again in Lost Legacy. Uh, we had a lot of new characters introduced to us. I didn't talk much about them. Uh, we had Sam, Rafe, and Nadine which I loved all those characters. Sam is voiced by Troy Baker, and I cannot wait to be playing that Last of Us game. So I'm going to be playing them actually after the series, so that's going to be really cool. Um, Nadine, I really like that she was a mercenary. Man, she kicked our butts many times during the game. It was kind of ridiculous. And then Rafe, he's kind of like your typical bad guy. Uh, he, he had everything. He was like, I got all the funds. Let's do this project. <laughs> But anyways, guys, I think that's all my thoughts. I really enjoyed this game. It's time to move on, and I'm sad to see this go. Do you think they'll ever make another Uncharted? That is kind of my question. I mean, I think they'll make another Uncharted movie. Uh, actually, I'm going to watch an Uncharted movie after I'm done You're recording this. I kind of i am in the feel of it. Actually, before this series, I watched all the Indiana Jones movies, and, <laughs> and I was like re-watching some of the Tomb Raider games and stuff like that. I was just kind of really getting myself into the mood for this game. But anyways, I want to say thank you guys for joining me. This has been a phenomenal journey so far, and 
just thank you for just being here. I mean, this is just so fun, and I had a fun time. I, You know what? Not just a fun time. I had a blast with this game. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Um, I'll see you guys somewhere else in time, and yeah, you all take care. Alrighty, guys, so we had something pop up at the end of... I just looked at it with some add-ons. So we got some skins, like... Look at this. Alright, we got the jumpsuit, the auction. Imagine playing through the game with a tuxedo. That'd actually be pretty, pretty baller. Um, I did like his Scotland outfit. His Scotland outfit looked pretty nice. And uh, we got the classic looking outfit. Actually, I'm surprised they don't have the classic outfit. So for Sam Drake, pretty much the same. You all love the waiter look. Pretty cool. All right. And then Victor. I like his aviary, you know, attire. He doesn't got many, but you know, I mean, most of his style is pretty much the same. And then Elena. All right, we got also kind of the classic outfit. <laughs> the epilogue. You know, imagine playing through the game like that. <laughs> Actually, old man Drake be looking a little, a little old. Look at the look at that gray. Uh, and then we got Nadine, which is kind of interesting. Very interesting. And then we got Rafe. All right, prison. Yo, <laughs> imagine the last boss fight. He's wearing a tuxedo fighting you. That actually be pretty baller. That'd be funny. All right, so that was pretty much it. We got some weapons, too, that we can unlock. Which is pretty cool. And then we got the render modes. Imagine playing the game through this. I didn't realize I had so much stuff. Deep Vision. You can play it. You can play Noir. That's funny. Vintage. I didn't realize this game had a lot of stuff you could do afterwards. Mirror World. What is that? Mirror on Death. Hmm. Slow motion. No gravity? I'm not gonna lie, I kinda wanna test see how that looks. Ape Helium? Infinite ammo is definitely something I want. Imagine playing that on infinite ammo. But anyways, that was kind of just a little extra thing that kind of popped up. Uh, I just wanna say thank you guys and yeah, I'll see you guys uh somewhere else in time.